Morningside friends, it's Miss Neat and Hayden. And we are missing our Morningside friends an awful lot, especially our morning hugs. So today we thought we'd read you a story called Tiny T-Rex and the Impossible. Tiger. And it's by Jonathan Stutzman. Hello, Pointy. Are you okay? Not today. I feel sad. I do not want to play. Tiny T-Rex and the Impossible. I have tiny arms. It is very difficult to hug with tiny arms. Each day I am growing taller, but my arms are still tiny. Hugging almost seems impossible for a Rex as tiny as me, but I will try anyway. Pointy needs me. Where is my father? I will ask him for advice. Hello, father. Rexes are thinkers, not huggers. Perhaps instead of hugs, mathematics might be the answer to your problem. Pointy does not like math. Math will only make Pointy feel worse. Hello, Aunt Junip. I have a problem. I must learn how to hug, but my arms are too tiny. I have found that balance is the key to any problem. Balance and freshly squeezed cucumber juice. That is disgusting. I will ask my mother for help instead. <laughs> I have fallen and now I am lost. I do not think I will find my mother in here. Oh, hello, mother. It's okay if you can't hug, Tiny. You are good at many other things. You are kind and creative and braver than most. You are tiny, but your heart is big. I cannot hug with my heart, mother. I must learn to hug with my, my arms. arms. Hello, sister. Hello, brother. Please help me. Hugging is very difficult. We'd love to help a tiny. To do the impossible, you must plan and practice. Practice, practice, practice. Thank you, Trixie and Rory. That is good advice. I will plan my strategy. I will get stronger. I will practice very hard. I will practice my hugs on everyone and everything. Maybe not ice cream. Definitely not. I will not practice on that anymore. I am almost ready. I will practice one more time. When I am done, I will find my friend. This tree is very big like pointy. I will hug it. That is not a tree. I have made a mistake. Please help. From up here, everything looks tiny like me. I could hug anything I wanted. Now I am falling. I should not have let go. I will never find Pointy. Oh, hello, Pointy. Hello, Tiny. I am here to make you feel better. I have practiced very hard and hugged many things. My arms are still tiny and my hugs are still tiny, but I will do my very best because you are my very best friend. Thank you, Tiny. That was the biggest hug ever. The end. So, hey, it's, was it impossible for, for Tiny to hug? Yep. No, but he had to what? What do you have to do to be able to hug? Practice. He had to practice. So sometimes we have to do things over and over and practice them when they're hard, but then they get better, don't they? Yep. Yeah. What was one of the things that Tiny shouldn't have hugged? Cactus and ice cream. Cactus and ice cream. Right now, we can't hug a lot of people, but we can hug our family. And remember, we're sending our hugs to you too because we miss you. Keep reading, keep practicing your math, and we will see you really soon. Bye.